Well, four places in uh, Mumbai, that's what they have told us, including uh, offices uh, of Videocon Group of Companies and New Power Renewables, a company that was floated by Deepak Kocher. CBI said that they had registered a preliminary inquiry in this uh, matter, and for eight months they carried out a, a, a due uh, uh, investigation, and what they found was that there is enough evidence to say that quid pro quo happened in this case. Chanda Kocher and ICICI Bank always denied this, but they have said that a 6% commission was paid to, uh, to, uh, to the Deeper Kocher after uh, ICICI cleared a loan of Videocon Group of Companies. Now, one must remember that Videocon Group of Companies is a debt written company which had a huge liability. Despite that, a 3600 crore loan was cleared by ICICI Bank. Uh, on basis of media reports, CBI had registered a preliminary inquiry. Uh, under the scanner is not only Deepak Kocher but also Rajiv Kocher. Uh, last year, Rajiv Kocher was detained at Mumbai International Airport when he was leaving for Singapore and was questioned at length by CBI. CBI said that. Uh, the FIR will name all the key players. Uh, when we asked whether Chanda Kocher will be named, they said uh, they refused to reply to that question, but they said that all key players in this case, including Deepak Kocher, Rajiv Kocher, and the and the head of uh, Videocon group of companies will be named in the FIR, which will soon be made public by the CBI. All right, uh, Bhav